to me here he's already requesting that matter a court time for each so we'll work according to plan please Mr. Metenish, okay, do you okay, have anything? Okay. So we'll start from Mr. Metenish because he was the first. So you get it. So we'll be giving yeah. three minutes max. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Well, let the order is well, like, like you talked about the situation even here in the country, matter about uh, the people who are in places where they cannot even afford. They tell you their problems, you will not be able to bear it. You, you see, Life is really, if, if you don't have a conscience, you won't even think of like, can I even help this person with five dirham? You just look at the situation and pass by, you see. So that's why I was suggesting that if you have like 1,000 dirham to send back home and you decide you want to send monthly, then that maximum should be 20,000. Otherwise, if you're not sending every month, then you can decide to, to change the amount. So, okay. but for me, in, in the end, it really boils down to your conscience. What what, what is comfortable with you, what, what your mind will tell you to do. It boils down to you. But whatever your conscience tells you, you should match it with what is coming in, in your account, with how much you are earning. And see that, can I live, if yeah. I live like this, after five years, what will I achieve for myself? Because in the end, it has to be you. Because if you don't achieve anything, then it is pointless for coming here in the first place. And in the end, yeah. the same people you were trying to help that caused your downfall, will still be the ones to mock you and laugh at you that your friends came here, they, they, they have made it, they, they have businesses and all of that, and you are a failure, you came here, you were running behind ladies, That's, that will be the story, you see? Yeah, yeah. So for, for now, I think number one point is your conscience, number two, you match it with how much you are earning, for now, that's what I have to wow. say. Thank you so much, Mr. Metheny. Hello, Mr. Legend. No. What I've what I wanted to say, I've already said it already. So okay. you can just skip to the next person. Okay, thank you so much. Hello, sir Bam Bami. Hello, sir Bami. Are you available? Please you can unmute yourself. Okay. If he's not, we'll move to Mr. Think with me. Hello, Mr. Think with me. Please unmute yourself. Thanks for joining. Yes, as always, Martha. Sorry I'm a bit late today. We got stuck in traffic. There's some kind of uh, accident on the way. But uh, I'm glad to be here as always. And uh, as usual, keep up the good work, Martha. It's a good thing. Yeah, but even still on the journey, I was in the background. You know, I'm always in the background listening in. And uh, like always, I, I, me, I'm going to look at it in a different angle. You see, Martha, we all, in, in this year, you were working for multi-billion companies, right? These yeah. are companies that operate on big time capital, right? Mm -hmm. Despite all this big capital, okay, these guys operate on a budget. There is a certain amount of money for each and every department to accomplish a goal. Which goal is 